Hello everyone, welcome back to episode number two of the Oh So Cooking Around the World. How did we do last time? <laughs> we done very well. <laughs> it was delicious though. Oh no, it was. It was lovely it in was. fairness. No, it was, for, it was lovely. You don't get to see us eating it because Even though it was it's not a vlog. But yes, it was a pork. It was not a beef stroganoff. But it was absolutely marvellous. So I really hope that you enjoyed the video and that it gave you inspiration to cook a beef stroganoff. Tonight, we... <laughs> it was pork. <laughs> it was pork! In your beef stroganoff. <laughs> Thank God we got that one out of the way. <laughs> Moving on. Tonight, we are going to <laughs> Mexico! Oh, we are doing chicken. It's really oats, chicken. And it's it's really, really chicken. chicken. It's not beef, it's no. not pork, it's not fish. It's, it's chicken. chicken. Chicken fajita boats. We are also doing a little cheesy nachos to start. And we are also doing our own homemade Mexican wedges. Mexican wedges, all washed down with a margarita. Yes. Skinny margarita? <sighs> nah. Okay, so what do we need to do first? We need to get the cheese on to these nachos over here, which are all pre-grated and some jalapenos. We're adding the jalapenos. What dip are we putting in the middle? Well, we says we would go for the sour cream. We're just going to do the classic sour cream. So as well, I would need to add. We're trying to really sort of budget ourselves to a tenner of me. Yeah, tenner of me, let's say today. Well, how today probably is, about oh, 10 euro. It is, it says less because we only use two breasts of chicken. Yeah. And, um, you know, so. Yesterday's was more because we used so much beef. No, what <laughs> are you New splash. There is now. More pigs in Spain than humans. Is that because of Corona? No, that's just because they just bred a whole lot of pigs. Mm. Okay, we're now going to put this underneath the grill just until it's nice and grilled. Oh, another fun fact. One time, oh so Mr. Murray thought it would be a really, 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 really good mm -hmm. idea to make nachos. He put them underneath the grill and do you know what he done? Forgot about them. Set the whole oven on fire. I thought we were going to die. Hi. Because he left them on there that long, the oven I ended them. up like all black. And Where were you? No, they were on fire. I had to yeah. pull them out of the oven and put a tea towel on top of mm -hmm. them because these ones mm -hmm. had literally caught fire. They were a light. They were a lit. Yep. So it's down low enough to enough. Yeah, we're good. So now we have low fat sour cream because we are health. Always remember, we are health. No, it would have been nice to have some chives. Yes. But they only do chives at Christmas. I know. It's so weird. annoying. Very hard to get, especially during lockdown. Yeah. Um, no. Absolutely serves you right. <laughs> Almost. It didn't catch on fire, but that was very, very, very close. <laughs> that actually serves you right. <laughs> Here are our slightly burnt. Nacho cheeses. <laughs> I feel like the brine adds to the depth. In it go. Would you like one? I'm sure you would. Oh no. We decided to do Mexican wedges. Basically all we done, cut the potatoes into wedges. We then put... Oh, hold on. Hold on. We then put three tablespoons of olive oil in with them along with Cajun spice mix, mixed it all together, put it in the tray, and now they're going to go into the oven for around 40 minutes. Gives us enough time to have a tequila, a margarita. Into the oven. Fun fact about margaritas. News flash. Ding. What's the, the fun what's oh. the fun fact? What's the fun fact, guys? Just decided to start really drinking. Fun fact the real housewives of Orange County, tune in. Very bad. Very bad. They drink skinny margaritas. Still in the. 
<laughs> so have we got a skinny one or a fat one? What's a wine stop for? <laughs> What's, What's a wine, wine stop? What's a wine stop? A wine stop? Chris, what? I missed out a chunk of that.
on the, the plane. plane on the way to Spain. So we pre-cut our onions, our pepper and our garlic all into like, as you can see, nice little fine cubes. If we were doing fajitas, we would do them much chunkier, yeah. wouldn't we? But because they are boats, we decided to do them nice and thin so it all fits in the boat nicely. So they're all pre-prepared. Did you see it? <laughs> so we do not drown. <laughs> <laughs> so they're all pre-prepared and then we're going to pop it in here once it's stopped sizzling or simmering. Not really sure what it's doing right now. Sizzling. Simmering. Simmering. Same thing. Where is it? We are making guacamole. <laughs> One each. One each. Megan is I'm making doing onion-y, onion-y uh, coriander guacamole. And, and I doing? am doing chili and parmesan. Mm, yum. So if you try these at home, because obviously you will be, because you're following us every single day, obviously. Let us know what guacamole you prefer. Do you know what this is? This is like a burst off. The guacamole <laughs> challenge. <laughs> Get me the spoons. Parmesan is my Italian guacamole into mine. I'm putting in a teaspoon of garlic powder. So am I. Oh, are you? Mm. Coffee in. Mm. See, I feel like yours is more on the Italian edge. That's all I'm saying. I don't know what's running away with yourself. Let me have a look at it. It has to be watery. It is. Yeah. The Oxo trick. The Oxo cube becomes a flat O cube. A flat O cube. Okay, so now we've put in our little cube of the oxo. We're gonna put in one pepper, one red onion, three cloves of garlic into the dish. That looks so colorful. Pinch. A little pinchy pinch. Pinch, punch, first of the month. It's first of the month. Well, <laughs> that's what it is. <laughs> Half of a juice of lime into our little chicken boat mix. While that is simmering, simmering. we are gonna put our little boats, which are here, into the microwave. The potatoes have left the oven. <laughs> have left the oven. We hope that you enjoyed your trip to Mexico. I know we did. We did, we had like, such fun. So much fun. Mm -hmm. You get tequila that is really wine. Watch your head. And you get to spend lots of time with oh, chihuahuas. Don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on that notification bell to see where we are going to tomorrow. If you have any suggestions of where you would like us to visit in the world, let us know. But not the difficult places now, like oh, Alaska no. and stuff. Oh, oh no, no. Um, well, we could do a bit. Are Mongolia? We could do a bit to Alaska. And we could do Mongolian beef skewers.